Hello friends, welcome back to Best Way to Study. In this video, we are going to discuss all the official declaration dates regarding NEET Counseling 2019. So, NTA officially declared that from tomorrow, that is uh, from June 19, 2019, the first counseling, the first round of counseling for NEET, that is for medical as well as dental is going to begin from tomorrow. So let's see few more details regarding that. Uh, so from June 19th, uh, the first round of counseling is going to begin. The first round of NEET counseling 2019 is going to start. And the first round will be conducted from June 9th and it will be continued till June 24th, 2019. So from July 6th to July 9th, there will be second counseling so these are the official dates of need counseling first round as well as second round now let's see few more details regarding the need counseling so uh, the first counseling timings the first counseling timings are from june 9th to june 24th and the timings are from morning 10 a.m to the evening 5 p.m. in between there will be half an hour to 45 minutes of lunch break at max of one hour lunch break so and the procedure will be continuing throughout the day uh, it will start from uh, morning 10 o'clock and it will end at evening 5 p.m. sharp so and the students who fail to attend to the first counseling or uh, who missed out the first counseling then happily go to the second counseling and before counseling you need to register yourself for counseling so there's a registration form you need to fill that you need to uh, pay the application the minimum application fees and the application fees will be different for different uh, categories so based on that you need to uh, fill your application form and pay the application fees after that you will be given an application form uh, sorry a form where you need to um, select the stream of yours and uh, select which colleges and all so it, it will be based upon the rank as well as the score of yours so and uh, the second counseling as i told uh, will be started from july 6th and now let's see a few more details so the students who have successfully crossed the cutoff and who has successfully cleared the examination are eligible for need counseling so uh, based upon your rank and based upon your score your uh, counseling dates will be scheduled so keep visiting the official website of need uh, very frequently and now let's see how to apply for counseling okay well, as uh, from tomorrow the counseling is going to begin so now let's see how you're going to apply uh, or how you're going to register yourself for need counseling 2019 okay so first you need to go to the official website that is ncc.nic.in i'm repeating mcc.nic.in in okay so once you go there, uh, you can see the link uh, which appears with the name of UG Medical Counseling. You need to click on that. Then you will be uh, redirected to a new page and then uh, you need to click on the tab which appears with the name New Registration. After clicking on the New Registration, you need to fill the page. You need to enter all the valid details after that. Uh, you after uh, filling all your valid details you need to click on submit and then you have to make the payment of your uh, for your uh, counseling uh, for your registration and then it's successful like you're done with the registration for need counseling 2019 okay so now let's see what are the documents which are required during the need counseling 2019 so let's see the documents first you need to carry your need admit card either it is uh, mds or either it is pg you need to carry your need admit card 2019 after that you need to take your all original certificates educational certificates 
since tenth to present. Okay, all the educational certificates you need to carry with you, and uh, later you need to uh, take even two to three copies of uh, Xerox copies of your educational certificates, and you have to carry uh, recent passport size photos at least five. And then you need to, uh, if you are a reserved candidate, you need to carry your caste certificate as well as income certificate. After that, you, uh, if you have any uh, medical issues, health issues, you need to carry your medical uh, issue, uh, certificate as well. And uh, so uh, the application form which you have filled, after filling that, you will be getting the receipt, right? After making the payment, after the uh, successful making uh, payment of the need counseling registration see once you uh, successfully make the payment you will be getting a receipt that is must uh, you need to carry it it's mandatory for you to need uh, like you need to carry it for uh, the counseling it's must uh, and uh, you should also carry your uh, few more certificates such as uh, if you have internship so completion certificate you need to carry that and all those stuff regarding to the the things and so after completion of the first counseling if you are if there are like uh, more left out seats then they'll be also uh, calling you for second counseling and after every counseling if you're still not uh, happy with the college which you got then you can go to the web counseling or the spot counseling so it is called the management quota there uh, people will be uh, addressing you regarding the college which you would like to get into so there uh, you can happily get the college uh, which in which you want to study so that's it for today i uh, hope you found this video useful don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for more such videos and like and share this video with all your friends uh, all the very best for your counseling uh, this is one of the blessed degree you know uh, so concentrate make sure you uh, study well concentrate well and uh, you know take this course seriously because it's related to uh, one of the you know the greatest ever uh, greatest courses ever so don't take the course for granted um, so that's it for today thanks thanks for watching all the best for your counseling and subscribe and hit the bell icon for more such videos like and share this video and that's it thanks thanks for watching